Coach Kim here, excited to give you an eight minute full body workout. You know what's great? You need nothing but your body. Your body's the machine. So make sure you got those good clothes on, or should I say comfy clothes on, some solid supportive shoes, maybe a towel and a water bottle, put that smile on them. Remember to always talk with your doctor before starting an exercise program. I love Jack LaLanne. If you don't know who Jack LaLanne is, he is the godfather of fitness. That guy opened up the first gym in 1936 in Oakland, California. He started his first fitness show from 1951 to 19, I believe it was uh, 84, but I'm bringing Jack back. Coach Kim's bringing Jack back. And the reason I talk about him is because exercise is king, nutrition is queen, and together it makes a kingdom. That was one of his quotes. And I, I am gonna just bring that quote back and bring him back. So we have an eight minute total full body workout. You don't need any equipment except you. It's gonna be 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. So it's a minute each exercise, eight exercises. So I'm gonna do one round of each. As you work up your fitness, maybe in another week or as you do a handful of these lessons, go ahead and do a second round and then eventually a third round. And I promise you're gonna be burning calories, strengthening muscles, and you have a big smile on your face. So you're welcome to do this every day or every other day. If your muscles are sore, let them rest. So let's get ready. First exercise is gonna be high knees. I've got the timer going on, you don't have to count. So on the high knees, you just, this is, High knees, low impact. You can do high knees, high impact. So do what works for you. 40 seconds of work. Ready? Three, two, one. Put those hands out. High knees. Again, you can run, whoop, or you can do this one right here. It's easy for me to talk to do here, but get those knees up, land soft. A healthy heart is a happy heart. Yes, I got that timer going. Movement is medicine. Motion is lotion. You're gonna be chanting that in your sleep by the time you're done watching some Coach Kim videos here because there's a lot of truth to that. And exercise makes you feel better, not just physically, but mentally too. Hang in there, you've only got 12 seconds. Whew. Yes, this is all gonna be short and intense, just like me. Here we go. Five more seconds, and that's three, two, one. Great, all right, so while you're resting for 20 seconds, we got 20 seconds on the clock for rest. You're gonna put those feet shoulder width, Toes facing forward, head forward. If you have bad knees, remember not to squat as deep. So we're gonna do a squat with a twist. So I'm gonna have your hands out, shoulders back, tummy tight. Remember to always breathe through the movement. So let me show you the exercise first. It's a squat, stand, a twist in one direction. Squat, stand, twist in the other direction. Make sure you engage the core as if someone just gave you a sucker punch, but they would never punch you. In three, two, one, at least I'd hope not, right? Squat. Right here, we got 40 seconds of work. And remember, you're alternating. That's it. If your knees hurt, just don't squat as deep, okay? You do what works for you, but squatting is a very functional movement. You're gonna do it all day long, every day, until you're 110 years old. Think about us on the uh, public toilet seats. You know, you really don't wanna sit on them, but sometimes you have to. Well, this is gonna build up that strength and maybe you don't have to sit all the way on it. You can just sit and hold that squat, okay? Here we go, 10 more seconds. Is your tummy pulled in? Yes, engage that core. Couple more seconds. Three, two, one. 20 seconds of rest, breathe. So while we're resting, let me do the next exercise. Speaking of good old Jack Lelaine, he's the one who actually had that jumping jack. That's who it was named after. Pretty cool little trivia there. We're gonna do a back jack, which looks like this. Elbows high. Now the option for this is just the steps. So if bad knees and hips, take me up on that option. In three, two, one. Let's go back jacks. And I really want you to pinch that upper back. Palms are facing down. Option, step, step. You do what works for you, keep it moving. Feet, arms, move, move, move. Love it. Love the way it makes me feel. You know, my family likes me better when I move. And I like myself better when I move. It's just, it's good energy, it's good stuff. You're almost there, 15 seconds. Yes. Now, if your shoulders are hurting you and you need to pump the arms this way or do a full jack, I'm fine with that. Okay, so keep those arms going. A few more seconds. Whew, that rest is coming. Yep, 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 it's three, two, one. Good, 20 seconds of rest, perfect. So next one, alternating lateral lunge to a calf raise. Again, it's gonna get the heart rate up. You're gonna lateral lunge to the side. If your knees hurt, don't bend as far. Both feet facing forward, come up, up on the toes. Then go to the other side. Lunge, stand up. I said lunge, not lunch. Okay, here we go. In three, two, one. 40 seconds of work. So lunge, stand, 
up. Lateral means side. So we're going to the side. Stand up on the toes, works the calves. Yes. Down. If you need to slow down the pace, that's fine too. Up. Yep. The fact that you're doing this and you're working. You know what? I'm very proud of you. You're a very small percent of the United States, people that live here, or even maybe you're out of the United States, but people that decide to move their bodies. You've got 10 more seconds all the way up. The exercise guidelines, 150 to 300 minutes a week of cardio, twice a week of resistance training, whoo, and only 20% rest up of people actually do that. Did you know that? So be proud of yourself for being a minority. Next one, butt kickers. Go, we all need a butt kick in here and there, don't we? Okay, so butt kicking from the side looks like this, the hard version. Pumping the arms, see how my heels. Option, right here, okay? So you pick what works for you, but we got 40 seconds of that work. Calories are burning. So we're combining cardio, strength in three, two, one. Let's go. Whew, butt kickers. I love it, okay? Option, slow it down a tad, okay? So don't press through. Okay, that no pain, no gain, that back in the 70s, that's, that's gone. We don't talk about no pain, no gain. But if you don't move it, you lose it. So keep going, you're halfway. 20 more seconds. So again, either run, and it's a butt kick. See, I'm kicking my butt. And if you don't have that flexibility to go all the way back, that's fine. You can always go back to the march, okay? Here we go, 10 more seconds. Butt kick. Can we breathe and get winded? Good. Three, two, one, 20 seconds of work, we're almost done. Three more exercises. Now this one, a hinge to a reverse fly. Your feet are gonna be hip width. I'm gonna show you from the side here. My knees are soft. Pretend you're shaving your legs, okay? I know my guys are going, I don't shave my legs, but just pretend. You're gonna hinge at the hip, soft knees. Bring your hands down below the knees, and then you're going to do a reverse fly. Out to the side like a T, stand back up. I'm gonna do it one more time. Hinge, make a fly like a T, come back up. Let's get ready, 40 seconds of work, feet hip width, and three, two, one. Hip hinge, like you're shaving the legs, then come out, make a T, don't let it go back here. Come back down and up. Try not to round your back. Hinge unless you wanna wake up with a bad back. Up, make a T, come back up. Watch me from the side here, feet hip width. Stick your butt back, hands down, soft knees. Do you feel it in the back of the legs? Yes, all the way up. It's gonna help strengthen the back of the legs, the lower back. It's called your posterior chain. Okay, all the way up. There's meaning and her purpose behind everything I do, I promise. All these different movement patterns will help you with everyday life, okay? And this reverse fly is gonna help you with your shoulders too and your posture. And rest, very nice. So, whew, next one. Standing tall, hip internal external rotation with an outer leg lift. Try saying that 20 times real fast, so you don't have to do that. So you can take one leg, I'm using my right, you use your left. Let me demo first. You're gonna roll it out. You're gonna roll your leg back. Then you're gonna go out to the side. The standing knee is soft. The other leg, you're gonna roll out. You're gonna roll back, hip internal external rotation, outer leg lift. If you have to hold onto a wall or chair, go for it. Three, two, one. Roll out, roll back, outer leg lift. Make sure that standing knee is soft. Other leg, roll out. Your hip's gonna love this, out, back. As a matter of fact, you're probably writing in the comments right now that this is amazing, your body feels good from moving it, out, motion is lotion. I'm gonna chant that theme a lot. And notice I'm alternating, and then out to the side. Good, 15 more seconds, roll out, back. There you go, again, hold on to the wall. This does take some balance. So let your eyes fix on something if you need to. Boy, every muscle is appreciating this. Good. All right, so stand tall. You've got 20 seconds. Last one is a reverse lunge with a Y raise. Put your hands on top of your thighs, shoulders back. You're gonna step behind you, and at the same time, you're gonna sing the YMCA song. YMCA, come back up, alternate your legs. If your knee hurts, just dip back, lift the arms. If your shoulders hurt, just you can limit your shoulders, okay? You can just do an arm curl instead. Do what works for you, but let's get ready. Three two, one. Reverse lunge, lift the arms up. YMCA, you getting tired of my singing yet? Up, and come back down, good. Singing is fun, dancing is fun. So is exercise snacking. You know what exercise snacking is? It's not eating a bag of chips while sitting next to your 10 pound dumbbells. It is taking the stairs, instead of the elevators, parking far away, 
and it's dancing and singing and moving your body <sighs> while you're cutting those fruits and vegetables in your kitchen. Here we go, keep going. All the way back. Can you tell I love exercise? I've been doing it since sixth grade. Love, love, love. Just, and I love to help folks like you every day, helping you feel better and live a healthier life. One more and rest. Woo! Now, you just finished eight exercises, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. And as you start feeling more fit and more capable, I want you to add another round to make two rounds and then eventually three rounds, okay? Do what works for you. Every day works or every other day. Thanks for joining me.